Let's rewind to 2009, when the world was reeling from a financial crisis and trust in banks was at an all-time low. Out of the shadows, Satoshi Nakamoto introduced Bitcoin, a digital currency not controlled by any government or bank. The magic, decentralization. Bitcoin uses blockchain, a public ledger copied across thousands of computers, making it nearly impossible to cheat or forge transactions. With only 21 million Bitcoins ever to exist, its scarcity and security made it digital gold, a hedge against inflation and uncertainty. Bitcoin proved a decentralized digital asset could work, opening the door for a global movement. It's the headline act, the first to show we could transfer value online without banks. Its creation sparked a wave of innovation, inspiring thousands of new projects. Bitcoin walked so the rest of the digital asset world could run, and that's how the digital revolution began. After Bitcoin, the digital asset world exploded with experimentation. Early altcoins tweaked Bitcoin's formula, but the real breakthrough came when developers asked, what else can blockchain do? Suddenly, blockchains weren't just for money, they could represent ownership of art, tickets, or even company shares. This shift led to programmable blockchains and decentralized applications, or dApps. The space branched out, some projects focused on privacy, others on speed, and some on connecting blockchains. Now digital assets aren't just about being the next Bitcoin, they're building the foundation for Web3, the next internet. The landscape is more diverse and specialized than ever. Enter Ethereum, the world's decentralized supercomputer launched in 2015. Its big idea, smart contracts, self-executing programs on the blockchain, enabling everything from automated payments to complex apps, Ethereum became the go-to platform for building decentralized applications. Then came NFTs, non-fungible tokens, unique digital assets that prove ownership of art, collectibles, or even event tickets. NFTs are digital certificates of authenticity, making digital ownership real and verifiable. Next up, stablecoins. Unlike volatile cryptocurrencies, stablecoins are pegged to real-world assets like the US dollar, offering stability for payments and savings. Each of these assets serves a different purpose. Ethereum powers, decentralized apps, NFTs prove digital ownership, and stablecoins bring stability to the crypto world. Together, they show how far digital assets have come since Bitcoin. The ecosystem is now a toolkit for building the future of finance, art, and the internet. It's not just about money anymore, it's about creating new digital realities. The possibilities are endless. Bitcoin, Ethereum, NFTs, and stablecoins, each plays a unique role. Bitcoin is digital gold, simple, secure, and unchanging valued for its scarcity and reliability. Ethereum is a platform, not just a currency. Its smart contracts power an entire economy of decentralized apps. NFTs are digital collectibles, each one unique, representing ownership of digital or physical items. Their value comes from scarcity and community, not as a currency. Stablecoins are the bridge, designed for stability, backed by real assets, and used for payments and trading. They connect the traditional financial world with the digital one. Each asset has a distinct purpose, and together, they create a more functional digital economy. The digital asset world isn't one size fits all, it's a toolkit, with each tool designed for a specific job. What can you actually do with these digital assets? With Ethereum and DeFi you can lend, borrow, trade and earn interest, all without banks. DeFi apps offer higher yields and instant loans, accessible to anyone online. NFTs are revolutionizing ticketing, gaming and digital memberships making ownership and authenticity provable and transferable. In gaming, NFTs let players truly own and trade in-game items. Stablecoins protect savings in unstable economies and make global payments fast and cheap. Imagine property deeds as NFTs or artists getting paid instantly through smart contracts. Digital assets are building more efficient, transparent and user-owned systems. This isn't just speculation, it's a new way to interact with value. The impact is already real and it's just getting started. Why does this matter? Because digital assets are reshaping money, ownership and the internet itself. Like the early days of the web, this tech is moving from niche to mainstream. Digital assets in DeFi offer open, accessible financial systems for billions worldwide. 
They put control back in your hands, not banks or tech giants. Understanding Ethereum, NFTs, and stablecoins will be as essential as knowing how to use email. The digital asset revolution is just beginning. Booms, busts, and breakthroughs await. By learning now you're preparing for the next evolution of our digital world. Don't get left behind.